to all those who devoted their lives to aviation. The Wings of Russia Studio presents Wings of Russia documentary. The design bureau was headed by Marat Tishenko. It was important for him to prove that the mill design bureau was still a strong team. A significant and efficient project was required. MI-26 became the one. Its payload was somewhere between MI-6 and V-12. The main idea of the helicopter was its high lifting capacity. It was supposed to carry as much as its own weight. The design bureau struggled against excessive weight of systems and units. In result, the machine layout was made at the limit of durability. Fiberglass was used for the blades in order to lower the weight and increase the resource. The titanium main rotor head also became lighter. However, the rotor system weight reduction aggravated the outer rotation when the helicopter had to descend with the shut-off engines by using energy of the winding rotor. The first liftoff took place in December 1977. MI-26 was piloted by the crew of test pilot Gurgen Karapitan. Further test flights showed correctness of calculation. The helicopter had impressive capabilities of transporting heavy and bulky cargo. The machine was of high demand. It started to arrive in the combat units in the end of the 80s. Civil aviation obtained MI-26 as well. This helicopter performed well at transporting very heavy cargoes with the help of external load sling system. MI-26 proved itself a reliable and often indispensable machine in fighting fires and natural calamities. 